Madam Superintendent, staff, and board members, my name is Kurt Roars, and I have children who are being educated in high school. I come here this evening to address the board and staff members on the DP Equity Program. I reviewed recent board meeting information. Would like to add my citizens' comments as permitted by Arizona Revised Statutes. It appears that since my last visit here, district policy has taken a hard left turn. It's quite doubtful that this reflects the opinions of many parents in this district. It is only a result of manipulations by misguided social activists that have duped the district into supporting their radical platform. Some of the policies appear, appear to be based on the discredited programs put forward by Gary Howard, the main author of the controversial and highly prejudicial Deep Equity Program, which has now been exposed on national media as deeply flawed and socially repugnant. We also realize the program has been pushed forward by the now radicalized ASBA, the Arizona School Board Association, which unfortunately is no longer a reliable source of objective guidance for school boards. It is apparent that this type of sectarian doctrine should be rejected by the board as inappropriate for school children of this age. These are political discussions more suited for adults that should be more capable of the critical thinking necessary to properly examine the doctrine. The Deep Equity Program is based in part on disparate outcome theory, which holds that differing outcomes with respect to race and ethnicity are primarily the result of inherent biases. This is a denial of the more sensible and obvious explanation that disparate outcomes are primarily caused by disparate inputs related closely to the ability and effort of the students in question. I firmly believe that most district teachers and staff are actually apolitical and have little interest in this social revolution pushed forward by radical activists. I also believe that most teachers genuinely care <clears throat> deeply about children and derive great personal satisfaction teaching them as their students. This is a celebration of teaching as a craft instead of just an occupation. Let me make a very clear statement to the board rejecting this egregious and despicable claims of the Deep Equity Program, which we have seen. All white teachers are not inherently racist any more than any non-white teacher is. This is an insult to their professionalism and devalues them as human beings. It's simply a vehicle to push a platform of so-called social justice by means of actual social injustice, vilifying one social group in order to promote another. I understand that the district is facing a very difficult situation declining enrollment. This current policy of social justice activism, which it actually is, should only cause the situation to accelerate as many parents reject these policies and seek other choices for educating their children. Thank you. Thank you.